Hello, it's Brenda, and I wanted to make a grocery haul video. I haven't made one for a while, and we went to Trader Joe's and went to Super Supplements, and I had some products that I wanted to show, and so I'm just going to go through and give you kind of a rundown of some of the things that we got. Um, right now, with the new year, I am doing a body cleanse, total body cleanse, and this is an organic one I really like. It's by Renew Life. I really like this, this company, and it the cleanses are um, really simple to use, and you don't feel all bloated and gross all the time. Uh, I also wanted to show this. Um, Jolly Time now has 100% organic uh, popcorn, and so we tried that this, and it's really good. It does um, pop up really nice, and you don't use lose a lot of kernels. So this has been a really good find. And just a camera girl is now um, going to start going um, gluten free. And I was talking to her about this product. Um, this brand is the only pasta that I use. I've I've tried all of the pastas, and this is by far has the best texture. Um, and you, if you use it uh, and go by the directions. Uh, then you can't really tell the difference between regular pasta and this is just a brown rice the little shells uh, but it's wheat free gluten free so if any of you are interested you should check that out it's a really good product and I'm gonna start doing my smoothies again so I went and bought some stuff for it this is the vitamin that I take I had my gallbladder out last year in like February March like the end of February and I have trouble um, digesting like really um, big multi-vitamin pills and liquid works well for me and I don't feel nauseous so I'm gonna do that and then this is an acidophilus um, a probiotic blend and I really like Yarrow um, formulas is the brand and if you're interested this is a really good probiotic this is the whey powder, the protein powder that I'm going to use for my um, smoothies. And this is actually sweetened with stevia. It doesn't have MSG and all of the milk is RBGH free. Um, it's really good. It has a really good taste and texture. Another thing I wanted to show you um, my family has dealt with a lot of like congestion and allergies and um, ear infections and I got these I gave one to Caitlin and one to my husband for Christmas and they are for ear candling I'm gonna make a video of it when we do it um, and it should be kinda funny so uh, I'll tell you how I like those uh, we went to Trader Joe's and so I'm just gonna go through and show you what I got um, I got a lot of veggies, so I got tomatoes and zucchini, and then for my smoothies, I got uh, blackberries, strawberries, and I make sure that this is just the fruit. Um, I get organic if they had it. They didn't have it in sh the strawberries, but there's no sugar added, just straight um, fruit. And then these are looked really good and they're all natural free of pesticides and they're wild um, blueberries so I wanted to try those and then I got organic raspberries I got organic broccoli, corn and peas I got um, avocados and some bananas I really like this applesauce it's not organic but it's naturally sweetened with apple juice um, and this is it's really chunky and thick and it's good like if you heat it up and put some granola on top of it and it tastes like um, apple cobbler uh, so that's a really good applesauce I like and then I got some sugar snap peas and some of the pre-cut stir-fry veggies um, I work and I don't get home until about six and so I try to get meals planned that will I can get on the table within a half an hour so a lot of times you will see me buying some pre-made um, pre-packaged stuff but I, I try to have it as natural as possible um, just but it makes a big difference to have the stuff so that's cut and um, easy for me to grab I haven't ever tried 
this sweet potato bisque. That looked really good. And then my husband wanted some chili. So this does not have MSG in it. It's usually pretty hard to find a chili without MSG. So it's chicken chili with beans. And then I got, uh, I make a, um, like a trail mix and I bought all the nuts to make another batch. And I do have a video on it that you can see and I prepackage it in these little snack bags so they're really easy to, to go and they're like 100 calories each. Uh, I got romaine lettuce and then some organic sour cream and some, uh, I love gorgonzola on salad. So this is um, all natural but it, it is not um, organic. I got organic milk, orange juice, and then um, egg whites, brown eggs. My husband really likes this granola. It does have quite a bit of sugar in it, but it is like organic cane sugar. Um, it's cheaper to buy it this way than in bulk, so we got a couple of those. And then these were new at Trader Joe's. These are organic wheat flour and corn tortillas, and I wanted to try those out. And, and see what we thought, but um, because we haven't been able to find a really good tortilla shell uh, that we like. So I really like this was organic and it was wheat. So uh, like I said, we try to eat a lot of gluten free, but if we do eat gluten or wheat, it is organic. Um, I found the, some organic tomato paste, uh, some stir fry, some cooked shrimp for that stir fry. And then my my daughter, um, she doesn't like fish, so I'll do some uh, meatballs for her. And then I got some tuna, which really good. And I'm going to make some lettuce wraps this week, and I got some chicken. And then I got some ground turkey. So all together with everything, it was $142 at Trader Joe's. So I hope that you guys like the grocery haul and you have a great day. Bye.